at that time, like I said, you know, Rick was becoming really close friends with Hulk Hogan and Hogan Knows Best was a big, big show. And they were developing a Ric Flair version of Hogan's Knows Best. I think the name batted around was Flair's Family. I've heard a different name, but they were going to do a reality show with Ric Flair because obviously like, well, this Hulk Hogan reality show was successful. Ric Flair is going to be just as successful and they're going to have the family and, and film everybody. And it was going to start with Reed wrestling in Florida and I was going to be his opponent. Mm. And Rick pulled me aside and and told me this. And, and he wanted me and Reed to go over the spots and how this match was going to go. And me and Reed were, you know, getting our chemistry down and we were going to wrestle this match in Florida. And Brooke Hogan was going to just happen to be there and then, like, Reed was going to hit on Brooke, and then the two fathers were going to go at it. <laughs> like, it was going to be all set up like, you know, reality, reality shows yeah, are. But reality. that was going to be the thing that kind of spun off into a thing. And I remember clearing my calendar because, like, Rick was very vague about it. He goes, I want you to come down to Miami with me. Uh, we're going to have a good time. We're going to be there for about a week. We're going to film some stuff, and you're going to wrestle. Okay? And, you, and you bought a speedboat. Oh, uh, no, <laughs> that, 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 that would have been one piece of information too much. Like he he didn't he didn't discuss anything more than what he just said. So I was like, okay, well, I guess I'm going to Florida. I'm wrestling, and he was he was going to tell me in like two weeks. And I'm like, okay, great. Well, I don't need flight info. I'll just wait around for it. And all this was supposed to happen, and I'm like, I don't hear anything back. And then I started hearing about this, and for a while, I kind of felt like maybe Rick is bullshitting me. And it wasn't until like probably oh three years ago, two years ago maybe, I was doing a comedy show at Jackie Knight's Comedy Club in St. Augustine, Florida. And one of the comedians there was a PA for like, I think Pink Shoes Media or Pink Shoes Production <laughs> House, the people that produced Hogan Knows Best. And he recognized me some from some of the early footage that they recorded wow. while we were training with Reed. And he goes, man, we had such high hopes for that show. Because, <laughs> you know, Hogan knows best was going to be good. But with Rick, oh, man, that was going to be even better. And they had this whole reality show mapped out and the things they were going to do. They'd already filmed some B-roll footage and some footage of Flair, like running training and training us and all kinds of stuff. And it was going to be this big thing. And I was going to be on this reality show with Reed. And then this incident comes up and then it's never discussed again. And then they realize that they need to focus more on getting Reed's life back together. Damn. 